Hello and welcome back to Fallout 3 with your story loaders in the mad. Hi Lord of Lotus, how are we just in level 22, boxes mad when cutest fucking this is 13 and all around little guy. And last time we were ambushed by a pair of super mutants as soon as we actually accidentally activated some show business machines. What were you doing with the team cancer? I think he was planning something evil with him. Another system room. Control chamber. Oh. Can we unlock it with this? Apparently, apparently we could. So... Elaborate. Oh, hey! That worked. Good. Security button 1. Attention all museum security personnel. The International Ordnance Museum has graciously loaned us some of their prized antique weapons for the firearms exhibition being displayed in the atrium. The exhibit will be in place from August 14, 2007 until December 31st, 2077. Please adjust your rounds accordingly and have an extra security presence in this area at all times. I'd like to request that all riot gear and security firearms be moved to the new gun locker in the planetarium research office. The cabinet should remain locked at all times. The key to the cabinet must be carried by the duty shift supervisor and left in the security office safe when shift changes occur and at closing time. The Museum of Technology annual gala dinner will be held in the atrium on November 1st, 2077. We expect over 100 attendees, including several local dig dignitaries and heads of state. Please set up security checkpoints and provide visible coverage for this event as per security mandate 99078 in your handbook. Yeah, that works. Oh, what was that? I saw your number zero 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 zero. Find info there. Oops. I think someone may have heard the shot. Ah, it was nothing. Ah, they're over there. Didn't I see another computer? Ah, it's a dirt control system again. Get the plan with this. All right. Uh, corporate. No. There we go. Contained. Let's keep that nonsense. Remove target inf information and activate. Have fun, friends. Oh, hello. Where did you come from? Ow. I didn't know I could fit through the door. Had I known that, things would have... I would have chosen a different path to handle things. That worked at least. Weapons. Still in danger. I don't know if this is still an issue. I'm gonna deactivate it just in case. We still need a key for this. Hey, master, do you have a key? Nobody has your knees assault rifle. Which is pretty good. I think I require one of those. That's a corpse. Uh, 
I think that corpse signifies the fact that the Durrets did their job. Up to a point. This is sledgehammer, wrench, clipboard. Empty with the box, empty suitcase. Ooh. Let's take all of that. What's this? Due to increased power consumption from the install. Yeah, I think I read this. Yeah. That console has nothing new for me. That's more than one enemy over there. No, I'm not being just silly. What are you talking about? I need something louder. What are they doing over there? Can I just move over this without being injured? There we go. I should have stamped that those two are mine. What are you doing? Come out, come out, wherever you are. <laughs> are they not actually up here? The Delta IX rocket was donated by the United States Space Administration and by a grant from the United States Department of Antiqu Antiquities. And that's cool, I know, but uh. No, I wanted to activate the rocket. Shit. I can taste your fear. You're the one hiding. That's one of the score bags, isn't it? Your ass over here then. Oh, I've got something special for you. But this one I didn't expect. Oh, that's first aid box. Why are they in directions that don't make sense from my initial plans? Are they not complete idiots? Where is he? He might still be a complete idiot. Seriously, where did he go? Maybe I should have just kept the thing live. We're supposed to be cautious right now, but we are stuck instead. 
Can I unstuck from here? Because I cannot move from here. Can I jump? No. Alright. Easy solution. What's this? No secret notes here. Do I have the... At uh, the metro map I have deck museum loot. Da -da -da -da. I read that one, yeah I remember that one. Yeah, that's... Guns. Information about guns. So, have they both gone up there again? Come out, come out, wherever you are! Can I stealth it that? Bad enough. Oh. Ah, but this gives me the opportunity because I think I'm being chased right now. So, if I were to, let's say, secure the corridor like that, to get this. Actually, I'm not sure if I want to get this. I still have a lot of ammo for these guns. I want that. That's five damage. That's four damage. So my worry is about that not damaging as much as the other option were unfounded because that gun is rubbish anyway. Good to know. Then sit many with the submachine gun on the other hand is perfectly handy. I think I'm going to retreat behind this mine. In hopes of our new friend joining us. Briefly. Quickly. There we go. I like to make my mines explode. I request you help me with the task. There we go. Shit, this seems pretty accurate. Yeah. I may be wrong there. Well, it seems pretty accurate. That's my assault rifle. Good shape. A little bit of repairs. Don't really do it any harm. What you got? Hmm, more of that. You? All the caps. Works for me. Any information on... That's number three. I need to find number one first, I think. This unusual flag was recovered from the surface of the moon by the very last manned flight to its surface in 2052. The flag is from the old Valiant 12. Virgo 3rd lunar lander that touched down no November 14, 1969. Its remarkable condition can be attributed to its construction. The flag is actually made of special materials to withstand the monument of space. This is the actual skeleton of Captain Carl Bell who died on May 5, 1961 after his space capture crash landed. Captain Bell is credited as being the first human in space on board the space capture Defiance 7, but this has been constantly refuted by both the Soviet Union and China. Defiance 7's fight lasted for a total of 12 minutes and 7 seconds as it achieved one full revolution around the Earth. Donated by Edwina Bell. Thought I saw something. Oh, 
Something I learned. There's apparently a button somewhere. That turns on lights. Cannot see any buttons. Where is this supposed button? Where can it be? What's this? No status effects. I was told there is a light. I still don't know how to activate it because it's dark here. Maybe if I walked into light. I'm on the 3000. What's this do? Can't turn the tile. That's not the light. That's not the light. How do I turn on the light? I read that there is a light. That's a lot of radio stations actually. Eh, who knows. This is the actual USSA deep space suit worn by Captain Carl Bell on May 5th, 1961. Captain Bell is credited as being the blue and Yeah, we read that one. That information anyway. Anyway, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.